it's time to remove my eyelashes. Might look kind of weird, so there you go. I'm just gonna cover it for your sake. Hi guys, my name is Michelle D, and today I'm with Preview to show you guys how I personally remove my makeup. And kasama na dyan dyan yung mga konting tips on how to maintain your skin if you find anything interesting in this video. Okay, so first and foremost, I do remove my lipstick first kasi parang yun yung lagi kong nararamdaman. So, I have this multi-purpose makeup wipe and this is amazing. It depends on what your look is, but normally I really do remove my lipstick first. Luckily for my shoe today, I just had to wear something light on my face. Nothing to exaggerate naman yung makeup ko today, so it won't be that hard to remove. For example, you always have to take care of the process for then because you can't take shortcuts with your skin or else your skin will age a lot faster. So I'm done with my lips and Para hindi sayang, I'll use the rest of the wipe since there are a lot of available spaces pa for the rest of my face. And try not to be too rough on your skin. Siyempre, your face has some of the most sensitive skins in your, in your whole body actually. Trying not to miss any spot. And then next will be my eyes. So what I like to do, if I'm using really extra sticky eyelash, eyelash glue, I like to get a cotton, a piece of cotton, and damp it with micellar water. Just so when I remove the eyelashes, it won't be too harsh on my skin around my eyelids. So there, just damp it like so. And just place it over your eyes just to kind of get the glue really, I mean, just to soften the glue really well. And then you do the same for the other eye. Just use the other side. And now it's time to remove my eyelashes. Might look kind of weird, so there you go. I'm just gonna cover it for your sake. Um, it just moves perfectly. Then I get another sheet. Since I am dealing with my eyes, you know, just get another sheet. So since we all know that our eyes have the most sensitive skin in our whole body, I usually go, I usually use my wipes in an inward motion just so it was a problem. And also, if you do it this way, if you're using wipes like mine, it avoids getting the formula inside of my eyes as well to really protect. So just follow that inward motion. And as you can see, my wipes is doing wonders. It comes off right away. Usually, after this phase, I do go to my bathroom and I wash my face with warm water. But for the sake of this video, I did prepare a warm, damp towel. And I'm just going to put it over my face like so. And this way, it really helps open up the pores to try and get any excess or leftover makeup that might still be inside. And we don't want that, right? We want to make sure that our skin is clean and fresh and ready to end the day. So just put it around your face for about 30 seconds to 1 minute. And I, I love having hot towels, it just feels really nice. Then after this, I have a two-step after makeup removal routine. and. Well, this goes for anything naman, like before I go to bed or right after I take a shower or when I wake up if I want to, just to protect my skin. So first, I use oh, I use a serum. And what I have now is a double serum that has 21 ingredients. And 
I've heard nothing but good reviews about this and it's worked wonders for my skin. And I just want to give you guys a gist of those 21 ingredients. So this has turmeric, banana, teasel, oat, avocados, merry thistle, mango, kiwi, and a lot, lot more. And that's why I love it because it's all organic. So I just take one pump of this and then another pump of the other side. Together and... and this really helps my skin feel tighter and younger. I'm not that old, but prevention is better than cure. We have to start early with our skincare routine before we regret it later on in our lives. Yeah. If there's one thing that you should invest on while you're young is yourself. <laughs> and then after this phase or this step, I do lock that serum in with a moisturizer. Just like our process earlier. Just massage it in your skin. And there you have it! It's really simple. Um, there's not that much steps in, in terms of removing your makeup. There's no one right process just do whatever makes you feel comfortable i've been using this for this method for a long time and it's been working for me so far so i hope that you guys have gotten some tips and tricks on how to take care of your skin especially after wearing makeup all day and yeah thank you guys for watching once again my name is michelle b you're miss world philippines 2019 Hello, ciao.